So you have a Samsung Galaxy S20, S20 Plus, or the S20 Ultra. I'm gonna show you how to add fingerprints as your security code, okay? So very, very simple. So first thing you gotta do is simply just go into your settings. You can just slide up on your screen like this. Go to your settings here. And then you wanna slide down and you wanna go down to biometrics and security right here. Tap on that. And now on the very top, it says uh, face recognition, but we wanna do fingerprints, okay? It says add fingerprints. We're gonna go ahead and tap that. Now you should have already put in your uh, pin, password, or swipe, and it'll ask you to go ahead and type it in here, okay? I put a pin in here before. If you don't have a pin um, swipe or password, it's gonna ask you to put that in right now. And the reason is, is because if your fingerprint doesn't register or something like that, then you always have a backup. You can put your pin, password, or swipe just in case. Maybe you got cut like I did here and then it doesn't register your fingerprint later on. Anyways, let me go ahead and put in my pin here. I'm gonna click on next. And now I'm gonna go ahead and click on continue right here. It says fingerprints, let's click on continue. And now it says, just a quick note here. This is basically saying that you should not use a fingerprint um, scanner if you already have a uh, screen cover protector on there. Also your screen protector, you should use a ultrasonic fingerprint sensor, okay? Just FYI, I don't have no uh, screen protector on here. Anyways, I'm just gonna go ahead and click on okay here. And now we gotta do is simply place our finger on here or whatever finger you wanna register. You can do uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different fingers on each hand, whatever you want. Okay, I'm just gonna do my one finger here, my thumb on my left hand. So I'm gonna press down, vibrates, let go. Press down, vibrates, let go. Press down, I just felt the vibrate again. Vibrate, 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 vibrate. So I'm feeling it. As soon as I feel it vibrate, I'm just going to go ahead and release it. So let's keep on doing this. And you can see it getting greener and greener. Okay, now get a full scan here. Reposition each finger to capture the edges of your finger. So I'm going to click on continue. Now I kind of got to go to the edges of my finger. Like just like the edges. Okay, there we go. Fingerprint has been added. Now you can go in and select right here. You, if you want to put another finger on there, a different hand or whatnot, you can click. Um, you can add another uh, fingerprint, you can click on add here, or you can just click on done. And then if you want to add another one at a later time, you can just go ahead and click on add a fingerprint. Okay. Anyways, I have my fingerprint in here. So if I go ahead and lock my phone right now, you see the little fingerprint mark right there. So you can just go ahead and just tap it just like that. Okay. Again, I can go ahead and just turn it off. And even if the phone's asleep, you can just go ahead and put your finger on it just like that. Okay. See, phone is totally asleep. Just lay your finger right there. Boom, or of course, if it's easier for you, you can just turn it on, know exactly where to put your thumb, that little mark right there, and you're in. Good luck.